All right, boys, we are here with break number 229. I'm actually going to go grab some more 55 point top loaders. I'll be right back. I have all the other ones we need. Let's see, just one second. Just in case, I, the playbook might need it if there's a certain autograph in there. I was going to say, I know the other ones are actually all 35 points, so we should be fine. But, you know, I'd rather be safe than sorry, so I want to make sure I get some more 55 points. <clears throat> and let's get rolling here. I'm going to bring up the thing. $10 break rate if you guys get an autograph correctly. Actually, a really, really good post reach lately, too. I was surprised how much... A, I'm happy that you guys filled the break, because a lot of football breaks when we hit a little bit to fill, so I'm really, actually, really happy that you guys did that. But as always, we got my man Cal Rookin Jr. here at Charm City. Ben Baller, in Project 2020. However, I was going to say, yesterday with the football, the guy that rubbed the box the best was Vlad Jr. So we're going to bring back in... Vlad Jr. and have him rub the boxes. We'll see if he can still be a good luck charm. But we had him rub and we pulled that Trey Lance yesterday. So, I was going to say. I don't have any more of those Black Guerreros either. I sold them for like $60 a piece. I was going to say. I was offering them in here for 16 bucks and nobody wanted any. I was going to say. I guess on eBay they were selling for a lot more. I don't know. Either way, boys. Let's get rolling here. We have XR. Playbook. And we have the contenders first off the line. We're going to run contenders. Ha! No one's, no one's buying a Vlad. The Vlad is my Vlad. I was going to say, that's the last one I need to complete the set. I was going to say, that's why he's so expensive. Actually, the last one's Mookie Betts. They're going for over $100. Let's say, let's get in to this Panini Contenders football first off the line first. Five autographs. I was going to say, you're going to get that red zone first off the line exclusive. Auto, that's going to be a rookie as well as the parallel. We'll roll into XR and we'll wrap it up with Playbook since Playbook is the new one. I'm, I only have one other box of Playbook. I'm going to get more of it. Just a matter of what price I can get it at and when I can get it. But I'm definitely going to get more. It seems like a lot of people are very, very interested in the Playbook. It's, I think this is actually a really nice mix of price to product ratio. Maybe mix in a mosaic instead of this. Content I have regular contender, so it'll be a little bit cheaper, but... I was going to say as well, but also maybe mix in a mosaic every once in a while instead of a contenders. I think you're going to get a, a nice mix. Ha! No, I have the Mookie. I was going to say I have 10 of them. <laughs> I buy those Project 70s in bulks of 10, and then I tried to sell them to people in the group because there were some guys that were collecting them, and then nobody... I kept buying them, and nobody else kept buying them back for me at the, at the discount, like, group price rate of $16 or whatever, so I just... Put them all on eBay, which is fine. It is what it is. Look, Kyle, we're, the Steelers are winning the division, all right, bud? Get over it. The Bengals had their chance. They epic failed. Three Super Bowl losses, tied for second most in NFL history. Get bent. I was going to say Ben Roethlisberger on the season ticket, Randall Cobb, A.J. Brown, as Kyle is now asking for a refund through PayPal. No, <laughs> just Matthew Stafford and start us off on the very first pack with an autograph going to the Buccaneers the linebacker Grant Stewart going to Mike Yo watch Trubisky have like a career year this year too like I mean I don't think it's gonna happen but it'd be nice have to, I have to be wishful thinking about it. It's, it is the reality that it is. We got Clinton Portis on the power players. Amari Cooper. Justin Herberts. Mark Andrews. Nelson Aguilar. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how any Browns or Bengals fans can ever get their feelings hurt. The agony they've had to deal with. I mean, I'm a Pirates fan, so I understand. We got Dak Prescott. Winning ticket, Aaron Rodgers for the Packers. 
going to Robert Paxson, David Johnson, Derek Henry, Cooper Cup, Sam Darnold, Michael Thomas, and we're going to have the chain movers, Marshall Falk, one of the best all-purpose backs in the league. Nice AA Ron here. Obviously got re-signed to the Packers on that huge deal so that he can go lose more NFC Championship games. Travis Kelsey, Lamar Jackson, Dalvin Cook, Miles Garrett, Miles Sanders. We have Gladiators on the Titans on Derrick Henry, Joey Bosa, Stephon Diggs, Aaron Rodgers for the Packers, Tom Brady. We're going to have 400 Panini points. We'll random this off at the end. Everybody that has a. Um, Let's see, everybody that has a number, or however many number of spots you have is how many spots you'll have in the mini. So, like, Mike will have more than one spot. Guys like Rob will have more than one spot. But this is going to replace one of the autographs that's 400 Panini points. Also, I'm going to have to take down the replay of the videos. Obviously, you can't go backwards while the, the videos are live. But we're going to have to, I'll have to repost this on YouTube for anybody that missed it just because of the Panini points. And, yeah, I think you guys kind of know why. Dak Prescott for the Cowboys. We're going to have Tredavious White for the Bills. Damian Harris. Mike Evans. Tyran Matthew. Marquise Brown. And Kadarius Toney. Means I'm gonna have to try because I didn't hit the record button, so I'm gonna have to try to figure out how to rip it. And take it down. We got DJ Metcalf. They do replace an autograph. DJ Shark Jr., DeAndre Hopkins, Tua. We have Rob Gronkowski on the first off the line parallel going to Mike. The Panini points do replace autographs, which is, in my opinion, absolute BS. David Montgomery on the power players. Antonio Gibson for the Washington football team. Derek Carr, Christian McCaffrey, Taysom Hill. Jerry Judy, rookie of the year, Michael Carter. I'm going to have Alexander, Godwin, Allen, Corey Davis, who I don't even really think played much this year for the Dutch. TJ Hawkinson. We have first rounders, the Jags and the Steelers. So that'll get random off between Jeremy and the Jaguars, which is Brad. We'll do that at the end when we random off the points. Justin Jefferson for the Vikings, Joe Mixon, Jamison Crowder, Devontae Adams. We're going to have an autograph for the Jaguars, and it's going to be the first off the line, and it's the rookie variation, Travis Etienne Jr. going to Brad and the Jaguars.
obviously we'll see what he brings to the table this year as he had the season-ending injury in preseason. Josh Allen, MVP for the Bills. Kenny Galladay. DeAndre Swift, George Kittle. Patrick Mahomes is second. Calvin, Calvin Ridley. Chain movers on a Michael Thomas. Chase Claypool for the Steelers. Carson Wentz. Aaron Donald. Terry McLaurin. DJ Moore. We're going to have round one numbers. It's going to be the between the Bengals on the Jamar Chase and Kyle Pitts for the Falcons. So that's between Ian and Kyle. We'll run a random at the end. Quite a few randoms at the end of this video. We still have two autographs. Alvin Kamara, Drew Locke, Russell Wilson, Jonathan Taylor, Kyler Murray, have playoff ticket Mark Brunel going between whenever he beat the Broncos in the 97. We got Adam Thielen, Nick Chubb, Fletcher Cox, who the Steelers are apparently trying to trade for, Brendan Cooks, Julio Jones, power players, Plexico Burris, Josh Jacobs, Darnell Mooney, Saquon Barkley, Jared Goff, Jimmy Garoppolo, Khalil Mack on the power players. Let's see, going to the Rams. Or not the Rams, the Chargers. I think the Eagles want too much for him. So we got Baker Mayfield for the Browns. Jalen Hurts. Aaron Jones. Rob Gronkowski. Allen Robinson the second. A rookie of the year. Najee Harris. Nick Bosa. Have Tyreek Hill. Hayden Hurst. Kirk Cousins. And we're going to have the first round pick of the Redskins. Or Commanders, Washington football team. Jamin Davis, linebacker. Going to Brent Wooten. Washington football team. Chain movers for the Bills. Josh Allen, Josh Allen here again. Jacoby Myers, Ezekiel Elliott, Juju Smith-Schuster. Have MVP contenders on the Joe Burrow. We're going to have Pete Warner for the Saints. Going to Chris Arndt. Cleaned up the break before Mike re-cleaned up the break as we had somebody not pay in a timely manner. Move on to XR that has two autographs. Two rookie parallels and obviously it has four numbered cards. Like I said, we'll wrap it up with playoffs since it's the newest one. Good luck to everybody in this XR. It's 14 cards. There is a basketball and a baseball both up. For anybody interested in those. The basketball still has some good teams and decent tiers. The football or the baseball has, I think, four teams left that I kind of put together a package if you want to close it out. We got Monty Rice for the Titans. Oh, yeah, these XR cards are very good looking cards. Going to the Titans and Chris. We have Khalil Mack, which is going to be a 67 out of 99 orange. 
going to the Bears and Mike McGarry. And we have another Khalil Mack, back-to-back -back Khalil Mack's 112 out of 199. We're going to have a Cortland Sutton, which is going to be 141 out of 199. Have Nico Collins, 22 out of 49. And I don't know why there were so many cards in there. That's that is abnormal. I was gonna say. Normally get a couple base. They hit us up with four parallels. Bonus. Let's say the Broncos, Cortland Sutton's going to Chris. The Texans are Chris as well. So Mike and Chris getting some numbered parallels in that pack. Normally it's two base in the front, and they hit us with. I was wondering why there was two or two Khalil Max of starts. I guess there's I mean honestly Khalil Mack is probably a cheaper rainbow chase than the rainbows you've been chasing in baseball. I was gonna say pick Alec Bohm, who's relatively high priced, and then I guess you were chasing Stott like second year or third year, so it's not too bad, but. It's a little bit of bonus. I mean, so they should go up. What am I doing? I was going to say, these should. These are hits. What am I doing? I'm so used to baseball where like every box has so many autographs that. Get Khalil back here next to one another. Nico Collins, I think he'll have a chance. I mean, if, well, I, I it all depends if Deshaun Watson. I'm assuming he's going to be gone. But it's actually a nice rookie hit for Chris. I think Nico has a chance to be decent still. It's out of 49 as well. And for the Browns, we're going to have Miles Garrett Gamers XR, and that's going to be 24 out of 49. One of the Brownies and Anthony Delisio. So apparently it was worn when they played the Steelers, which was probably a loss. So sorry that you got memorabilia where your guy lost the game. It's a shame. Or this might have been the game where he banged Mason Rudolph on the head. That could be really nice memorabilia. Freaking prick. Anyway. And then it looks like we're going to get an Anthony Schwartz RPA, 3 out of 10. The gold on gold, luminous endorsements going to the Brownies as well on Anthony Schwartz. Some nice gold on gold. And let's get into the next pack. Yeah, definitely with double up and on teams is rough. Can I can agree with that? Eric Stokes, rookie for the Packers. I have Josh Jacobs, Quinn and Williams, I have Tom Brady going to the Buccaneers, and that is an 88 out of 249 going to Mike. Yeah, I think they did a really, really good job on XR this year. Now, last year's XR was not so pretty. So they really stepped the game up this year, but a nice color match, Brady. Let's see. Two weeks ago, you, would, you could have said it was from his last year, but obviously it is not. I have a 50 out of 75, Sam Ehlinger for the Colts going to David Stemple. We've got Ron, Rondell Moore for the Arizona Cardinals impending, 6 out of 149. And that's going to Chris, who closed it up. And then we're going to have an autograph. Jalen Phillips, rookie. 11 out of 199 for the Dolphins. 
And that's going to Rob Jenkins. I wonder if Ehlinger is going to get a chance to start. I mean, I guess if they don't bring anybody in, right, he's going to be in open competition with the other guy. I can't remember the other guy's name right now. Let's get into the playbook. Four cards per box. It's four autographs or four memorabilia. I would assume it's a relative even even, distrib uh, even distribution of two and two for the most part. This flips up, doesn't it? It sure does. Let's say obviously silver pack. First card up, we're going to have a 101 Danny Dimes on the Daniel Jones. At first, I thought we were going to get knocked here for the Danny Dimes, but it's a 101 going to the Giants and Jonah Aldrich. On the Danny Dimes. One on one, going, going to place a Jamin Davis. Next up is the most bullshit of Panini ever, and it's going to be 900 Panini points. So, another random. At least this time it wasn't flipped, so we're going to have four randoms at the end of this. And this will replace one of the hits. Probably 900 points is probably a little bit better than memorabilia, but I don't think it's better than an autograph. And we're going to have Chris Godwin, Hot Routes, memorabilia 153 out of 299. Going to the Buccaneers. I'll just say it's so rare too, like for me to typically pull points to get them in two two sets of points in two different boxes is such BS. Let's so add a two ninety nine to Chris Godwin, and we're gonna have the booklet, and it's going to be a forty seven out of forty nine Chuba Hubbard, and it is a big juicy booklet for the Panthers. And Robert Paxton on the Chubba Hubbard. 47 out of 49 rookie jumbo memorabilia. For the Chubba Hubbard there. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm surprised they didn't put an autograph on this somewhere. The, I, the patches are nice, but yeah, I was going to say to go two memorabilia and then put points in there rather than an autograph and only have one. Even if it's a one one Daniel Jones. See, it's a little rough. 
We got 47 out of 49. Chubba Hubbard there, obviously the green rookie. Let's do a quick recap of the hits, and then we will random off the points. Obviously, with the Chubba Hubbard, I'm not going to keep messing with him. I'm going to put him in a team bag and put him in an immaculate box of some sort and ship him out to the person receiving. We have Chris Godwin out of 299. We have Impending Greatness out of 149 on the Rondale Moore. Sam Ehlinger out of 75 for the Colts. We have two Khalil Macks, the out of 199 Khalil Mack out of 99 Khalil Mack for the Bears. We're going to have the first off the line, Rob Gronkowski parallel. Kirtland Sutton, 199, going to the Broncos. Nico Collins out of 49, going to the Texans. I have Miles Garrett out of 49 for the Browns. Tom Brady out of 249 for the Buccaneers. And getting into the autographs, we have Jamin Davis for the Washington football team. Grant Stewart for the Buccaneers. Jalen Phillips out of 199 to the Dolphins. Pete Warner for the Saints, rookie ticket. Going to have the Anthony Schwartz, 3 out of 10 luminous endorsements going to the Browns. The 101, Daniel Jones going to the Giants. And then we have Travis Etienne Jr. on the first off the line autograph. Going to the Jaguars. Congratulations to everybody that hit. You guys still have a chance to get some points. 900 and 400 points. I think the points are going at what? Like 8 cents a point right now. I think is what they were up to. I think that's what Phil Hughes was buying them at. Which pushed the market up on them. Because they were at like 4 cents a point. Let's go over here and run the randoms real quick. I got to make room. Desk. get this the points going real quick set up on random.org here Just going to go in the alphabetical order that you guys had with your teams. <clears throat> All 32 entries here. We'll do first, we'll do the 900 points. Two, what was this? 229, right? All right, we'll switch over to in game. All right, good luck to everybody. That is in there. Obviously, all 32 people are in here. We'll get a dice roll of six or higher. We got a dice roll of seven. That'll work. Good luck. This is for the 900 points. Brad started off in the first after the first round. We have one round left. Jeremy was in the pole position. Let's see who ends up with it. It's going to Rob Jenkins on the 900 points. So that's going to Rob. Congratulations to Rob. Do a new giveaway. Have the same 32 entrance. We're going to do it for the 400 points this time. Get a dice roll of... Oh, four doesn't work. Get a dice roll of nine. Let's begin the giveaway. Obviously, eight rounds right there left. One of the final thing we got Dave in the pole position. Let's see where it ends up as. We got Mike McGarity getting 400 points. So congratulations to Mike on the 400 points. I'll actually share this one into the Facebook group. I'll get the 900 point verification in there as well. We'll have the video so you don't have to worry about it too much to know. Uh, but 
just in case somebody does ask, 400 points here is the verification for running it. And now we just have to do what was the randoms for the Jamar Chase and Kyle Pitts, and then the Najee Harris and Etienne Jr. Uh, so let's run those as well. Everybody else, I appreciate you guys watching. Um, hope you guys have better luck next time if you didn't hit this time. I know sometimes some of these breaks can be a little bit uh, rough if you, if you don't hit when you're trying to get, get some big hits in here. So I apologize for anybody that had poor luck. And the Falcons are in. This is for the Pitts Chase Round 1 Numbers card. Break number 229. A dice roll of 8. So that 8 is going to see who gets it between uh, Kyle and Ian. And Ian wins this one, so that's going to Ian. And then the Steelers is going to be between... Um, we'll share this giveaway. And this is for the pit slash chase. Congrats, Ian. Say for that one. And let's get a new giveaway here. So it's a, between the Jaguars and the Steelers. So that's Brad LaRoche and Jeremy Pace. It's going to be ETN slash Harris. Round one numbers for break number 229. We got a six. And Jeremy wins this one. So congrats to Jeremy. All right, boys. I appreciate you guys. You guys have a great night. Yeah, I can give you a better look at the... Hold on, I'll go over to the camera real quick. Um, and then I'm going to hop on off. As I say, it's pretty much just a dual player card. It's nothing too crazy. Um, I think they're going for a couple bucks if you look on eBay. Um, but they do have two players on there, so fair is fair. I have to random it off. Like I said, congrats to everybody that hit tonight. For anybody that didn't hit, uh, better luck next time. Like, I, I don't ever want to see anybody hit. I wish everybody could hit every single break.